yourself. There's a boat over there. Quiet in the cheap. There's a blue boat lying there, so it's at the beach of Muffington Island. Okay, we're one step closer to finding Faith. Let's recap. Faith went into the jungle. Where she took a boat that Bobby had hidden in the jungle. Do we really know that? Anybody could have taken it. But Faith knew about it. So let's assume that it's true. It's just... Where did she take the boat? To Muffington Island. That's right. We saw a blue boat there. It must be Bobby's. Good work, Larry. I calculate a 92.3% probability that Faith is now on Muffington Island. Then we should get there as soon as possible. Headquarters. Yeah? Not you. Yes? It looks like this Larry guy has located Faith. Excellent. Where exactly? On a neighboring island. Then you can take him out now. All I care about is Faith and her algorithm. I'll wait a little longer. Apparently, he saw her there, but I don't have confirmation yet. When the time is right, I will grab him and use my dreaded interrogation techniques. Nobody has ever resisted them. Do that. Do you have any interrogation techniques that involve wearing a latex costume? The kind with a zipper in the... I don't need one. They're washable. I'm sure it'll be easy for you to get blood off, too. Anyway, <laughs> they're really resistant to other fluids. Oh, <laughs> that's for sure. I'll remember that. Yan Mai, out. Oh, you can't always choose your customers. Can we go? So, everything should be taken care of now. We are good to go. Although... What now? I don't know how to navigate. We'd be lost at sea. The waters here are relatively uncharted, and I have no navigational data for this region. Maybe we should ask around the hotel, see if anyone there can help us. On my way. Any kind of map of the archipelago? We haven't had one of those for a long time. Bummer. I have to figure out some other way to navigate the islands. Oh, oh, we have a tourist app developed in collaboration with Unter for that. I could install it on your Pi phone for you if you want. That would be great. I don't want those fingers touching me. It's all wireless. That's better. I'm ready to receive. Did it work? App installed. Cool. Hey, man. Seeing as you're here, some woman left a message for you. Really? She's waiting for you up in her room. Great, but uh, who? She said her name was Faith. What? Faith is here. I knew it. Don't you think it's weird that she suddenly just shows up now? Doesn't matter. As long as she's here. I'm going to her room right now. Hey, 
Is the lamp broken? No, but I've been waiting for you, Larry. I love these kinds of surprises. This has got to be the best night of my life. Put on these handcuffs, Laffer. Sure thing, baby. Wait a minute. Somehow you sound different, Faith. Don't play dumb. I'm not playing dumb. It's just the way I am. I guess I'll just be going now. So you like bondage? Uh, this is not a game, Laffer. Oh, okay. <laughs> of course not, mistress. You will whimper before me. But of course. You obviously know no fear. Uh, of course I could be afraid if that's what you're into. But I somehow have the feeling that you've been stalking me. It's perfectly normal that you feel attracted to me. Just exactly how frightened do you want me to be? Something like this? Oh, oh. I, I'm so afraid. Quiet! What country do you work for? I've never worked in the country before. So, you're a mercenary. Because I'm quick on the trigger? You don't have to pay me for this if that's what you mean. I have been watching you. I know your abilities. And now I will find out your secrets. Then just ask. Should I keep being afraid? Oh, 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 oh! Quiet! Where is fate? Oh! You know each other? I know she was the boss of Prune, and that someone is very interested in her. That's pretty understandable. You're throwing smoke again. I have acquired torture certifications in five countries. I took first place in the ear shredding competition more than once, and no one has ever survived my secret weapon. So what is your secret weapon? My dreaded, wait. I'm not telling you that. Too bad. You're making me so confused. Which group do you belong to? I wonder how Lemma's doing these days. Don't play dumb. I've already exposed your cover, Agent Laffer. I have never experienced such resilience. He should be trembling in fear. What did you do with Faith's Pyphone? It was beyond salvation. He destroyed it in cold blood. Why aren't you carrying a weapon? Give me a good skin search and you'll find my weapon. Stop! I'm going to get out the fondue forks in a minute. I love fondue! Quiet! I have to think. Pi, do you have any idea what this is all about? Yes, but as usual, you wouldn't understand. He shows absolutely no signs of fear. He would probably survive any kind of torture. He totally confuses me. Could you speak a little louder? I can hardly hear you. Enough is enough, Larry Laffer. Why aren't you afraid? You are tied to a bed and in an utterly hopeless situation. Well, you yeah. could untie me and we could have a lot of fun together. I just can't believe it. You don't even know the meaning of fear. I like that in a man. And I like women who aren't afraid of me. I can imagine. On all my missions, never have I met such a perfect agent. What is your secret? I'll have to get very close to you to find out. There's plenty of room on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Baby, that was delicious with a pleasant finish. What a man of mystery you are, Larry. Oh, not at all. You are much more mysterious, Yanmai. I only have one secret, Larry. And? Between my training and the new gene therapy, I am not only a deadly weapon, but almost immortal. There is only one thing that can kill me. A righteous man's love. No, 
a KGB helicopter. That's what my shaman in North Korea foretold. That's why I hunted down and destroyed every KGB helicopter in the world. That's a very strange piece of information, but my instincts tell me I should remember that. Larry, are you done now? Didn't you have other plans? So I think I have some business to attend to. Well, uh, I'll see each other later, I guess. We will. Damn. Did I really tell him my secret? Larry? Yes? Do you plan on sleeping with every woman you come across? Hey, this is a whole new experience for me. Normally, nothing like this ever happens to me. It might be time for you to start learning to pull yourself together. But I have my first stalker. Not everyone can say that, even if she's a little strange. She is strange. Hi, can we go? We can navigate now. I don't see why not. All common sense aside. Common sense is totally overrated. Finally, I have my raft back. Now I can find out if Faith is still alive. But do I have anything to help me pass the... Just get aboard and set sail, damn it. All right, all right. Headquarters. Yes? Did you torture Larry? How many toes does he have left? Send me a couple. I forgot to put my toe collection back in the freezer a while back. Then I had to throw them all away. When I love toes so much, even when they're still attached to feet. I haven't found out much yet. Uh, he's on his way to the neighboring islands now, and I'll see what he finds there. Why is he still alive? Uh, there's something about him. We need to find out more. Start a background check in New Lost Wages. He must have been there and left a trail. All right. I'll take care of it. And, um, I may have told him a little too much about myself. What? Does he have better interrogation techniques than you do? Maybe I should hire him to find Faith. No, I have everything under control. I want to see some results. And toes! Hmm, let me put it this way. It's inhabited, at least. Be careful. That really doesn't look very inviting. Come on, what could happen to us here? I think it looks pretty cozy. I have a really bad feeling here. Oh, hello. I'm Larry. <laughs> Larry Laffer? It's a, a man. Grab him. Hey, not so fast. Ow. Hi, do something. I'm in your pocket, damn it. What the hell am I supposed to do? They've taken Larry to a hut. What kind of women are those? They look dangerous. I'd better stay hidden. You're a little rough. Well, not that I'm complaining. But it all depends on the situation, even more so in the 21st century than it used to be. The sensitivity training is finally having an impact. Damn. Quiet. I have to think. I'm Larry. <laughs> Larry Laffer. Your name is of no importance. Be happy. Your death will not be in vain. It will be of great benefit to us, man. You're alive! Faith, that's what that glowing box called me too. Maybe that used to be my name, but that's my past. But Faith! Don't call me that. Here I am known as the Queen. Of course you're a queen, Faith. It's a good thing that you're submissive to me. What 
is this place? This is our island. No man has ever set foot on it. Well... No man has ever left it. Our tribe lives here, secluded from the rest of the world. We live the way we want to live. Admittedly, the organization could still do with some work, but I'm on it. I also see room for improvement as far as monitoring the bay is concerned, Niwi. That was a misunderstanding on that thingy. That thingy is a scrum board, and it can only help if we all use it. Can't we just talk it over? Miwi, we have to keep up with the times. We can be much more efficient with a modern organizational structure. So, cancel my appointments for today. I have to deal with the intruder. You have no appointments, my queen. How did you end up here? I've always been here. No, you weren't. No, you weren't. You're Faithless, the boss, uh, former boss of Prune Incorporated, and the future Mrs. Laffer. You can even have one of those modern double names. Faith Lafferless. Hmm. Although now that I've heard it. Quiet. I am the queen here. You will obey me. It doesn't matter how I got here. I'm here now. And so are you. But not for long. Faith, can't you remember anything at all? Not even me. I've never seen you before in my life, worm. Uh, I've never made such a bad impression on a woman in my life. How come there are only women on this island? Because we don't want to have any men here, except on our plates. Wait a minute. Just to make sure there's no misunderstanding, by plates you mean... We eat men. Okay. <laughs> then I understood it correctly. <laughs> but why? Our holy book commands it. I saw a tattered book out there. Is that the one you mean? It contains all our tribal rules. It's been here longer than I have. The tribe's entire society is built on the rules found within it. And that book tells us how to deal with men. Let's go back to New Lost Wages. Where? New Lost Wages. Your former life. Everything could be the way it was before. You can even say prune. There's only one place I want to be. Here on this island together with my sisters. Let's go back to New Lost Wages. Enough. Lock him in the back. There's no meat on him yet. We'll have to fatten him up. And when he's fat enough, time for a feast. But Faith, you must remember. Prune, timber, the explosion on Cancom. I thought I had lost you. I even lit a candle for you. I thought I would be forever without you. I... Enough. Take him away. Headquarters? Yes? I've located Faith. So, she's alive. When will you be back with her? I haven't been able to capture her yet. And there's another problem. Well? It would seem Faith has lost her memory. What? How can that be? I don't know, but she now believes she's the queen of a tribe of female cannibals. Huh? Oh, just wait. I thought I told you not to eat the lube. Oh, so where were we? Queen of a tribe of female cannibals? Exactly. She doesn't know who she is. So that means she doesn't know where her algorithm is either. Whoa, so it would be pointless to bring her here. They even managed to overpower that super agent Larry. How do you want to proceed? I'll keep observing. I suspect that Larry has already come up with some ingenious plan to escape and bring Faith's memory back. Hey, get down from there! That's a sex swing! No swinging without sex! Oh, on second thought! Stay on it. I'll be done in a minute, baby. Right, Yan Mai. Continue your surveillance. Surveillance is good. I have to go. Oh, someday I'm going to quit my job as a freelance deadly secret agent and look for something quieter. Damn, the cannibal girls confiscated some of my stuff. At least they didn't find everything. <laughs> Hi. Yes, Larry? The prison in New Lost Wages was cozier than this. Is that the only thing you're worried about? Of course not. It would have made me wonder, too, if you weren't thinking about why. Am I going to have to eat man meat now, too? Uh, that is actually an astonishingly good question, Larry. But what do you want to do about Faith? It's easy. We break out of here, get her memory back, and then she and I finally have wild sex. Oh. What's this?
white clothes, gold necklace. Sir, could you by chance be a pervert? My name is Swingle, sir. I think I am the same as you, sir. A pervert. Oh, boy. This island just keeps getting worse and worse. I'm not a pervert. I just have extraordinary tastes. But of course, sir. That's what I always say when I get arrested. Is that a diving suit? Oh, yes. It's perfect for diving in all kinds of liquids. Totally washable, sir. How'd you end up here? Well, I came to Kalua because I heard there was a place here where even the most extraordinary desires can be satisfied. They call it the Cavern of Cosmic Cognition. I like caves, sir. That definitely sounds interesting. Unfortunately, the cavern's location is a mystery, a myth of the archipelago. Supposedly, one gains a deeper knowledge of oneself when one enters the cave. And what else could that mean but multiple orgasms? You find the ultimate pleasure. Did you find it? No, but that's all right. Even if you do find the cave, you can't just enter it because you need a keystone. Seafarers scattered the pieces to the four winds here in the archipelago centuries ago. Did you hear that, Larry? That could be interesting. What? I, I kind of quit paying attention after the bit about extraordinary desires. Then I preferred to explore what pleasures Kalua and the other islands have to offer me, and ended up here. The ladies talk about feeding me up so that I can provide a festive meal. Hey, just like me. What's the deal with these cannibals? I don't know, sir. They do seem to be very committed young ladies. When I look at the interior decor, then they obviously didn't come on a ship. No need to call me sir. I'm Larry. Master Larry, it is a pleasure to meet you, even if the circumstances could be more refreshing. You really can just call me Larry. Oh, sir, I would never even consider such a thing. Not even if things had become more intimate between us. Okay, this is all very strange. Now you find it strange. Not everything else that has happened so far? Are you saying that you don't find a tribe of lesbian cannibals normal? I think you need sensitivity training. It would be better if you started looking for a way to get us out of here. Damn, the cannibal girls confiscated some of my stuff. At least they did. Unfortunately, the cannibal guards are talking outside, but... That needs some electricity. I'm taking this with me, at the risk of someone thinking I'm a doctor. I could use that to hear stuff. There are two of those cannibal girls on guard duty out there. But it's just a phase. I think all of us go through it. It'll pass. But I'm just curious. What is it about men that you're so interested in? They're useless. I've never seen one naked. His, you know, yes, you have. I mean, not all charred and wrinkled. You'd be better off focusing on your job. Otherwise, the queen's going to be so angry again. Yeah. You're right. And don't forget to update the scrum board after your shift. I won't. See you later. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder what would happen if I pulled on it. Ah, so that's what happens. I already have a complete skeleton inside my body. I wonder what that's for. Definitely a... Locked. It fits perfectly. Let's give it a try.
It's too far away. I already... Mm, the third arm never hurts. When my arm's not long enough, there's nothing better than an extension. Looks pretty old and run down. It won't conduct a... That's where the break in the cable is. Do you have any idea how we can get out of here? But Master Larry, why would I want to leave? Because they want to eat us. But Master Larry, what's wrong with being swallowed? Oh, God. What is it, Master Larry? Good heavens, you've gone so pale all of a sudden. You, you? Yes, yes. You're even worse than I am. Oh, thank you so much, Master. But seriously, how can we escape? Well, we can't, but that's not bad. It's just about time for another meal. Maybe we should go on a hunger strike. But that won't fill us up. Okay, I'll take care of it myself. I got in here so I can get back out too. Mm, that's what I always tell myself during sex. Ugh. Who was that about the cave and the keystones again? One of the local legends, my dear sir. A cave is said to impart profound knowledge to all those who pass through it. Ecstasy, sir. Ecstasy. But unfortunately, it's not all that easy to get to the cave anymore. And you also need a lost keystone to open it. I don't think Faith remembers anything. What should she remember, Master Larry? Well, me. Her former life? Oh, God, how boring. Hey, I, I need your help. I'm sorry, sir, but I can't reach your pants right now. That's not what I mean. Can you reach that cable? Ooh, Master Larry. Electrical shocks. How wicked. And here at first, I thought you were boring. Should I attach the ends of the cable to my nipples? All you have to do is hold it. Fine, then. See you later. Let's give it a try. in here, please. What do you want? What are you two talking about out there? Did you eavesdrop on us? No, I, I wasn't sure what you were saying. That's why I was asking. That's none of your business. You're our prisoner, and I'm not even supposed to talk to you. Can I get something to eat? You'll get your food when I decide it's time. But I'm hungry now! It's mine to decide. Bummer! And here I am, always bringing someone something to eat. Uh, what's it like being a cannibal? What do you want to know? What do you ladies do all day? The Queen told us not to talk to strangers about that, but to be honest, it's exhausting. Ever since the Queen organized us, we've constantly had to do sprints. I hate sprinting too. Everything has to be agile. You girls look pretty limber to me. No, I'm talking about scrum. Scum? No, it's the way we work. Let's talk about something else. <sighs> I always get so tired when people talk about work. Get a job. If you're a man, you wouldn't be able to handle the job anyway. What does guard duty entail? You guard things. You have to patrol and inspect things regularly. Maybe you should do a cell inspection. Why? I could be planning an escape. You? <laughs> no one's ever broken out of this cell. 
The little guy is in bad shape. That's nothing new. He's totally sick in every way imaginable. He tells me about how great the sex is when you have an out-of-body experience. I mean, how is that even possible? I don't want to find out. I'm bored. Me too. I heard that you'd like to see a non-barbecued man naked. Well, we don't get a lot of that around here. And when we do, it's never for long. We could change that. Hmm. Tell me, are you a typical man? There are many things one could accuse me of, but no one would ever say I'm typical. Then you're of no interest to me. I heard... Well, and when... We... Hmm. You mean my tastes or my looks? Your body. I still have all my parts, if that's what you mean. Okay, show me. You sure don't waste any time. My shift's almost over. Do it. Okay, at least it's not charred, but it's still all wrinkled. He's asleep right now. Then I'd better let him sleep. Oh. You have to touch it. You should see what happens then. Oh, good grief. You stay out of this. Well, he's not entirely wrong. But now I've seen an original. Thanks. Always happy to help, especially when you don't get sued. Reminds me of your food. Now I really want some food. Well, it's not feeding time yet. But since you showed me yours, now I'll show you mine. Really? <laughs> Hold on a second. That does look very um, appetizing. At least a lot more appetizing than the... No matter what we do with that little guy, or maybe it just takes longer. My bodily fluids are always... Ugh, 